The Target 12 investigators take you inside the mafia now. We've learned one of Rhode Island's most infamous and elderly career criminals has died. Lawrence Mitch Lanou was released from prison just last year and died last week at 90 years old. Target 12 investigator Tim White has been covering Lanou for years and is in our newsroom now with the exclusive details. Lawrence Lanou clearly wasn't big on retiring. He was 72 years old when he was arrested in a failed armored car heist. But his most daring crime was also Rhode Island's largest. He was part of a team that stole millions of dollars from the mob itself. This eyewitness news video shows Lawrence Mitch Lanou in a familiar setting, handcuffed and under arrest. Formerly of one socket, Lanou died on January 8th of heart failure. According to the Department of Health, he was 90 years old. Lanou was released from prison in December 2010 after serving nearly 20 years for a failed armored car heist in Bellingham. In all, the U.S. Attorney's Office says he racked up 32 arrests and 12 convictions. Among them, Lanou was charged for his role in the infamous 1975 bonded vault robbery. A Target 12 investigation last year revealed eight masked bandits stole upwards of $30 million in valuables from a secret vault used by wise guys and their associates. Barbara Oliva was working the day the heist went down. You just would not believe it was knee-deep money, silver bars, gold bars, raw gems, uh, guns. Lanou drove the van that hauled the men and the loot. Though he was most well known for his life of crime, Lanou also served his country. He was part of a B-29 crew that flew bombing missions over Japan. With the Target 12 investigators, Tim White, Eyewitness News.